two I'm FX and this is really brother Carter. Alright, today we're going to be showing you how to make sugar glass. If you don't know what sugar glass is, it's like a glass but it's very highly breakable. Alright, you're just going to need a few store bought items for this project. Alright, here's, here's what you should get. Alright, you're going to want some cream of tartar, which is actually a spice. It's like a powder, it's not a cream. You can find it at the spices section. And if you're gonna want to make a lot of uh, sugar glass, you're gonna want to stock up on that stuff. Alright, you're gonna need a candy thermometer. Um, you're also gonna need some kind of a measuring spoon or something. You can also just use a real quick measuring spoon. I don't think I have one right here. Um, I don't know where I put it. I had one. There. Um, you're going to want one of these. Um, smallest. Yeah, one of these. A one fourth of a tablespoon. Actually, this is one half, but. So. Alright. You're also going to want to get your measuring cup. And some tin foil, some tin foil, some sugar, the tin foil, and this pan, this cooking spray. Those are uh, optional. And some water. water. And some water. All right. You're also gonna want a cooking bowl and two cookie trays, or just one, depending on what size you want your slab to be. Alrighty. Oh yeah, and you're also going to need one cup of light corn syrup. Alright, so when you're waiting for the liquid to come to a boil, get your aluminum foil in your pan. Ah! Um, Uh, make it as smooth as possible. Coat, coat it. That. Let me get some scissors. All right. Come off the end. But leave some hanging off. Then that can be perfect. or you can just spray the bottom of your pan with a uh, cooking spray. But this seems to work better. So, all right, let's go back to our mixture, which is now boiled. Two cups of water. Three and a half cups of sugar. It's a lot of sugar. One and a half cups of light corn syrup. And one fourth Tablespoon cream of tartar. Tartar, whatever. Tartar. Okay, yeah. Okay, so stir it and slowly, slowly bring it to a boil. Very slowly. Alright, so our, it's starting to boil. And as you can see, it's starting to turn clear. So uh, let's go ahead and put the candy thermometer in. Alright, so our sugar glass just reached 300. Turn off your heat. And if you're. Get it. Yeah. 
not old enough, get a parent to help you pour it into your mold. Now, there are going to be a lot of bubbles, but those will disappear soon. Try and pour it as evenly as possible. All right, so our mixture has dried, but it's still a bit hot and sticky. Ooh, it's sticky. So we're gonna keep letting it dry for a little bit longer. While we go outside. All right, so an hour has passed and it's all dry. Right? All right, so what you're gonna wanna do is lift, take your little tabs from the aluminum and it comes real easily as you're putting it. Ah, it's hot. Hot, 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 hot. Okay, bring the camera over here. Alright, so then you can just take the aluminum foil, slide so nice and easy, and it should come like that. Nice and easy, just nice and easy. Yeah, Not no, too hard. Don't rough out or your glass will break. Remember, this is still glass. Hey guys, what's up? It's Effects Studio 79. No, and you're not! I'm Effects Studio 79! Get out of my studio, Carter! I'm serious! For the no, last time! I'm Effects oh, I hate I'm you! Big Get big out! Well, I'm Get big out! Big oh my god! I'm a big Two!